Welcome back to this channel. If you're a blogger, content creator, or maybe you're making faceless videos for YouTube, today's video is for you. Before, SEO writing used to take a lot of time. Today, we are exploring the SEO writing.ai. I'm going to show you how these two can make your content creation process faster, easier, and way more efficient. So here in this video, this is the blog post we are going to be creating. All right, let's get into it. To access the website, you use the link under this video description. And when you get to this website, you need to sign in using either your google account or you enter your email address then you enter your password to do that you will come over here and click on get started for free then from here you can either log in with your google account or you can enter your name your email address your password and then you click on sign up after signing this is what your dashboard will look like so these are the three things we can do on this website you can create blog posts with just one click you can also generate blog article using this other option then if you come down here you can use their humanizer tool to write your article enhance humanization and readability improving your google ranking i'm going to cover all this in this video so let's pay attention so to create your blog post you need to click inside here for this you need to insert insert your main keywords after inserting your keywords then you enter your title so for this place i'll just insert my keywords so here this is the keywords i want to use so i'll just enter garnish that's the keywords i want to use so if you don't want to enter your title you can simply come here and generate a title and it's going to use these keywords to generate a title for you but if you have a title in mind using these keywords then you can type in your title here so what i'm going to do now i'm going to click on generate a title for it to generate a title for me and after some few seconds your title is going to be ready so if you can take a look at this title it was generated from these keywords this title is saying elevate your dishes with this garnishing secret so that is the title for this blog post so i can come down here this is the core settings you need to select the language you want to use so if you click here there are different languages you can make use of let's go on with the um, english us then here the article type so if you click inside here you can select the article article type there are different options available here we have the how to guide listicle product review news comparison and um, all these other available here so you can simply pick the one you want to use according to the kind of article you want to write so for this i want to use this how to guide so i'll select that then over here you select your article size so from this place you can select your article size if you select medium it's going to be um between 2400 to 3600 words so for this let me just go with the small it's going to give me 1200 to 2400 words then you come down here and select the tone you want to use the tone of voice you want to use for your content so if you click inside this place there are other um, available options here we have friendly professional informational transactional so for this i want to create this content about informational so i'll select informational there then this is where you select the ai model you want to use so if you click inside here there are different ai model you can use this is the default so here we have these two ai model that have just been introduced to this website we have the DeepSeek R1 and we have the DeepSeek version 3. What these two AI model does is that it helps rank your article by giving you a good SEO. So once you select any of these options, if you come down here in the um, SEO tab, if you select those two AI model, anyone you select among those two AI model, then they are going to give you an automatic um, SEO keywords, tags, and all those other things that is going to help your article rank very well into this SEO tab. So let me go up there and select one of these ai models so if i select this second ai model deep safe version 3 then we come down to this seo tab you can see that it's going to give us an automatic seo here so we don't need to start typing in any keywords or any tags relating to our article it's going to do that by itself for us then if you come up here again let's select the, sec the first one here deep seek r1 if you do that then you come to the seo tab it's going to give you automatic based on um s ERP. then if you come up here again let's select another ai model that is available here and not this particular one so if you select chat gpt 40 mini then if you come down here then here you need to type in your seo you need to type in your keywords or phrase that relate to your blog okay so that is why this particular two ai model is very important it helps you gives you an automatic seo based on the type of content that you are creating so these two particular um, ai model is a game changer when it comes to ranking your blog post or ranking your content so for this let's just go with the deep seek r1 
model so once that is selected you come here and select the point of view so for this point of view we have the first person singular which uses i me and my then we have the um, first person plural which use we us our us then for this let me just because i'm trying to talk to an audience so i'll need to select the second person you you are and yours so let's just select that then you come down here and this is the target country you are trying to target so if you click inside here you can select any country you are trying to target so for this target country let me just um, pick united states so once that is selected you can come down here and um select brand voice so for this since i don't have any brand voice created there won't be any available brand voice if you want to create a brand voice then you can click on create brand voice i'm going to talk about that later in this video now when you come down you can enter what details you would like to include in your article so if you like to include your phone number your address your location you can write that inside this box then if you come down here these are the media hub the um information that will be inputted into your article so here we can add ai images um if you click here you can decide if they should add ai image or if they should not so we select yes so that the our article is going to be engaging then the number of images they should add so for this let me just select five images the image style if you want the kind of image style you want to use is available here this is cartoon image style photo and all that so for this i'll just select cinematic then this is the image st size that you can select so just leave it at the 16 by 9 aspect ratio which is the default available there then additional instruction what you can write so here you can describe the kind of um, person what the, the person is wearing in the image you want to use okay you can describe that into this place there you can enter your brand name if you want your brand name to appear on the images you can enter it right inside here then now you come down you include youtube videos if you want them to include youtube videos in the video then you can add that enable it yes the number of videos they should include you can select um, up to 20 videos so for this let's just go with three videos then this is the layout options so from this layout option you can select alternate image and video alternate video and image first images then videos first videos then images so i'm going to select alternate image and video now you come down here this is where the seo comes in so here it says if you do not provide the keywords you will automatically generate the relevant keywords from the main keyword for each section and use them to generate this article so for that i'm not going to select anything there then this is the structure which is the introductory hook that is the beginning of your article so for this you can go with a question you should ask a question statistical or fact um, quotation and this so for this i'm going to select statistical fact so once that is selected you come down here this is conclusion if you want them to add conclusion you can enable it there if you want them to add table so for this i don't need table in this particular article i'm writing so here this is italics and all that if you want any of these things you can enable it by aligning the yes but if you don't want it then you can click on no then if you come down we have internal linking so here you can add select a website to add so if you click on add a website so let's say you want to link this to another website then you can use um, add a website option but for this i don't want to link to any website then here we have the external linking if you want to link um, out of the article then you can add um, automatic or customize you can customize any website you want to add to this okay then now you come down connect to web so leave this leave this as it is then you come down here if you want to create marketing materials based on the article for various platforms then you can enable any of this platform that you want to create uh, marketing material for then we have twitter post linkedin post uh, facebook post email newsletter we have whatsapp messages pinterest so if you want to create market marketing material for whatsapp message i'll just select whatsapp then click on yes then you come down here outline editor so allow all these other ones as they are then the target website that's the publishing website if you want to publish this to any website then you need to add your website using add website option okay and that's that you are done with the setting when you are done you need to scroll up once you scroll up you see run button here so you click on the run button so it scans to 100 and when it's done you can now preview your article now once your article or blog post is done generating then you are going to come here you can click on it to open it up so this is it elevate your dishes with this garnishing secret so if you come down here this was the, the statistical fact we use in why generating this article did you know that over 70 percent of dining experiences are influenced by the visual appealing of a dish so you can see that 
then see the images is generated if you want to regenerate another image then you can come here and click on generate another image then these are the key takeaways so you can see on under, the understanding garnish definition and um etymology so that is that if you come down this is a youtube video which is um as it has provided into our content then if you come down here these are other information available for this if you don't like this image and want to change this image then you can click on this um um, refresh icon and it's going to change this image for you so if you come down here you can see when i click on that it starts loading and you are going to see um, another new image for this particular place then if you come down you can see other youtube videos you can see uh, ai images that are generated into our content so if you come here you see we can yeah, we have our meta that um, tags yes if i click on meta tags you can see this is a meta title and this is a meta description so you can copy any of this put it into your blog and you um, upload then this is the syndication so we have the whatsapp message so this is um your whatsapp message if you want to copy this you can click on this copy and then you use this on your whatsapp um, status or in your whatsapp um, group anywhere you want to use it then this is the seo report so here we have the seo report um, the input data so you can see um, sub analyzing so these are the SEO this is why using um, any of those new AI model on this website is going to help boost your SEO uh, ranking and it's also going to drive more organic traffic to your post you can see this good effect using those two AI model that I just demonstrated in this video so now if you are not satisfied and you want to edit then you can click on this edit option to edit your post then you can copy here if you want to copy this and use it on your blog post you can click on copy or you can use the html um, version of this or you can click on this publish icon also if you click on this publish icon then you need to integrate your wordpress site to this particular website using this connect icon if you click on connect you are going to be able to connect your wordpress site to this and once you click on publish it's going to publish this onto your wordpress site so now you can use the humanizer tool on this website to um, rewrite your article. So if you click on the humanizer tool on this website, you are going to see this is readability. So eight and nine great easily understood. So from here, you can select any of them, but the recommended one is the um, eight and ninth grade easily understood. So if you select that, then here you can select the language you want to go for. Then after that, you can remove AI words. If you want to remove AI words, you can remove that using this option then after that you can come down here and paste input the text you want to uh, humanize on this website so if I paste in my test let me just paste in let's say this is my test now if I want to humanize this particular um, uh, content which I've just written I'll come down here and click on humanize and let's see the outcome of this so here you can see the outcome of this if you check um, our inputted um, text here the youtube journey from passion to platform then if you check here from here you can see that um, this was written by ai you can see the kind of text um, given me here then if you check here you can see how organized this now becomes youtube is more than a place to share videos it's a global stage then if you see here you can see this was written by ai if you read this you um, really know that this was written by ai but when you humanize this using this website you can see the outcome of what we have gotten here you can scroll down and see the outcome of this so once you are ready and you are satisfied with what you have gotten then you can come down here and click copy the html format of this or you can click on copy to copy the text and use it on any um, platform you want to use it on then now let's talk about the brand voice on this website to create your own brand voice then you need to come up here you can see brand voice if you select brand voice then you see options available here so from here you can create a new brand voice so you can see make it easy to write in your style with customized voices in content created on seo writing.ai so if you want to start creating your brand voice then you need to click on new brand voice so from here to add your brand voice you have three options available you can add a text uh, web scribe then you can also upload a file so for the added text you can add a text here yep, write or paste in any content available here so you need to have uh, we have maximum of 10,000 um, words available here then we have if you click on web scribe then you can add a URL link of um, to any blog post or any text heavy page um, website so let me just paste in a link here so here you can, you can paste in the link then you click on brand voice 
here you can upload a file so if you have a pdf file a document file or a docs uh, file you can upload it here then for this uh, web scribe you can input the the um, blog post link you want to um, imitate but make sure you have uh, you have the right to use the url that you'll be pasting in here now click on create brand voice so after some few seconds you are going to have um this available here so this is the name expert guide voice um, voice tone we have friendly confident instructional uses encouraging word language while maintaining professional expertise then point of view first person um, personal narrative then style of expression casual but authoritative so these are the style you um have so you can go through it and if you are satisfied you can still edit it clicking inside while you edit if you are satisfied then you go ahead and come here click on save brand voice or you can still add an element to this so if i click on save brand voice that will be saved now anytime i want to create a blog post i can come here where i see brand voice i can select on this option and i can add my brand voice i can use my brand voice expert guide so if i click on add brand voice it's going to use my brand voice while creating that so that is how to um, create the brand voice on this website so if you are using the free plan you'll be able to generate five articles then these are the things you'll be given access to if you are using the free plan then if you are using the starter plan which costs 19 dollars per month but if you are watching this video as my viewer then you can use my promo code showing on the screen and you are going to get 25 percent of your first purchase on this website so using my promo code on the screen or in the description of this video also in the comment section of this video i get you are going to get um 25 percent off so here for the starter plan you get up to 50 articles to generate you can see it is very nice then if you are using the professional plan which costs 79 dollar per month then you are going to um, get up to 250 articles and these are the things you need to know about this website it is a good website to use if you are into blogging or if you are into content creation it's going to make your content creation faster so it is something you need to invest in thank you guys for watching if this video was valuable then do not hesitate to like this video and drop a comment let me know what you think about this website in the comment section of this video